hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to my youtube channel first of all let me thank you all for coming here today i'm blissful and delighted to share some advanced vocabulary so let's get started so the first word is bodacious especially north american english it is an informal excellent extremely good predominantly used during the 80s and early 90s bodacious is a combination of the words like bold and audacious to be bodacious is to be impressive awesome brave in action remarkable prodigious if you say that someone or something is bodacious you mean that they are very good or impressive for example for internet addicts there is even a bodacious mouse pad home of the tulip amsterdam is a city of bodacious flowers this is a smart script a funny cast and a bodacious movie it was a bodacious concert solitude solitude it means the state of being alone you know the synonyms of solitude are loneliness solitariness recluseness retirement seclusion for example we enjoyed the beauty and solitude of hills more than ever she longs for peace and solitude after months of solitude at sea it felt friends to be in company the song is a pecan to solitude and independence mollifluous mollifluous it means sweet and smooth generally used uh generally used of a person's voice tone or writing style for example a mollifluous voice a mollifluous voice mollifluous tones when the snakes heard the mollifluous sounds coming from the flute they began to crawl back into the basket the singer with the mollifluous voice will win the talent contest when i was a little the mollifluous or pleasant tones of a tones of our preacher's voice put me right to sleep in temple sonambulist it means someone who walks while they are asleep a sleep walker person who walks around while they are asleep examples of sonambulist in a sentence there is a lot of sonambulist around sleep walkers controlled by society the sonambulist has no idea she sleep walk to the neighbor's house nearly every night in the day she went around like a sonambulist with accent there you know like gazing upon the world he had just discovered the most famous sonambulist in literature is lady macbeth her monologue in the sleep walking scene is one of the highlights of the shakespeare's play panacea it means something that will solve all the problems of a particular situation for example there is no single panacea for the problem of unemployment that is not to say that green tea is a panacea asian and russian people drank the healthful beverages for centuries as a panacea for a stomach ailment as to the colonization society it is neither a wicked conspiracy on the one hand nor a panacea for slavery on the other tranquility tranquility it means a disposition free from stress or emotion for example enjoy complete tranquility with birds you know singing in his groves of wild flowers there are ancient temples and countless colorful pagodas events of calm and tranquility as well as bustling markets full of noisy bargaining whole race realizes that poetry poetry works in exactly the same way and comes up with his notion of you know like emotion recollected in tranquility the yoga instructor will show us the best way to reach a tranquil state ineffable it means something so good that it cannot be expressed in words for example their happiness to ineffable height he had a smile of ineffable sweetness with white well formed teeth i felt an ineffable sense of joy and achievement when i received the medal sometimes music can produce an ineffable joy elegant it means a refined quality of grace gracefulness and good taste for example even now in her 60s she is the epitome of french elegance the pillars give a classical elegance to the room the statue has a gentleness and ambience a wistful elegance his writing combines elegance elegance and wit he conveys an aura of elegance and gentility 
patriarch patriarch it means the word patriarch refers to the scent of rain on dry earth and it derives from the greek name for what flows through the veins of gods it is the pleasant smell that accompanies the first rain after a dry spell for example i'm wondering if they will get the time and the open space to experience the petrichor in the air i surfaced from the tunnel in a sack where the air was close and smelled of petrichor when the rain fell petrichor scented the air petrichor emanating from grass was very pleasant this much for today thanks for watching my video if you liked the video please hit the like button if you want to see more videos hit the subscribe button and if you have something to say please leave a comment keep learning keep listening keep growing and keep experimenting take care and goodbye